Okay, the way this works is you're modifying a grotto. You're modifying the entrance of a grotto using your position. It's not it's not actually uh, your angle. Uh, to, just to start it out, it's not your angle, but it's the X position of the thing that you're holding, which is stupidly precise. I'm just gonna I'm gonna be looking for a setup for this for a while, but I'm just gonna cheat it in right now just to demonstrate. So then I could use my angle and where do I want to go? Let's say I wanted to go to spirit. Oh yeah, well, <laughs> I shouldn't do that, I guess, but it works. Does this mean 322.19 is coming? Probably. I am 90% sure this will go under under 320. When does run become safe now? Ganon. Well, assuming things work out the way we think it's going to work out. How much reroute will this require? A significant amount. I think most of the F boot stuff is probably going to stay relatively similar, uh, but everything not F boots is probably getting a complete overhaul. Although complete overhaul may not even be that big because there's a good chance that the boss rush kind of just gets ported to adult without like any real significant changes. Don't add the apostrophe. What apostrophe? Oh, the it's. No, I'm not going to add it. For you guys, cryhards. It's faster to skip the apostrophe. I'm going to find a setup for this using the X position of what Link is holding. And then we can just enter it with whatever angle. There's the grotto. There we go. Yeah, like that. So yeah, this is gonna be very significant. Now adult will be just as crazy as child. Well, not just as crazy because we still can't do F boots, but it'll be up there. Uh, this probably will still be one child, one adult. It'll just probably be more evenly distributed. Running it through in my head, uh, I actually think adult and child might actually be uh, even, roughly even time-wise. Dude, even for MM, like, literally right as Pope got, Pope got a run last night, and then, like, I, I think, I think the amount of time between when Pope finished his run last night and when I saw Kyle post the Grotto video, I think it was, like, literally less than an hour apart. I assume it was probably being discussed in Discord while Pope was still running, too. And I almost PB'd, too, last night. That would have been great if Pope and I both PB'd, and then immediately both our runs were obsolete by new stuff. But no, I, I had to go suck. Oh, dude, you want to know something else uh, funny and sad? So you know how last night I crashed on the warped double defense? So I decided, you know what? I don't like the setup for the warped double defense. I'm going to find a better setup so that I can more easily tell that I got it correct. I found a better setup, and now it doesn't matter. Oh yeah, speaking of messing up the heap, so you know how there's a Skulltula here, and so you know how it would probably be a good routing idea to get this Skulltula as you're doing this. So you would like set your angle and then get the Skulltula and whatever. So the heap is messed up right now to demonstrate. Uh, this is the heap right now. There's not that much stuff in Lost Woods. It is very broken. Things are not supposed to take up that much space. So killing the Skulltula crashes. So we actually can't act. We can't get that Skulltula at the same time we do this setup, which sucks because you would think to do that to be optimal, but you can't. Casual ask, which dude, this entire this entire run is gonna be extremely fragile. Yeah, it's the token spawning that causes the crash. Oh yeah, just for a reference with the heap. This is what the heap is supposed to look like with all that empty space. Just happens to be that when you do SRM, it just... Well, it breaks, but that was a different way of breaking. Thanks for four months, Ecorn. You don't like this game? Me neither. Actually, you know what? I remember I remember back when SRM was first found, and I remember people talking about uh, SRMing grotto entrances, like literally month one or two or something. Jeez, do you know like what's different now compared to like what people were talking about back then? I know the idea is not new. We forgot about it, nothing's different. Are you serious? Oh my god. I'm mad, dude. I thought these SRM guys were smart. Dude, all through OOT's history, or at least for a lot of OOT's early history, we were so bad at testing stuff. 
And I always thought as the years went by, we got better and better at testing stuff. But I guess I was wrong. Oh, they tried one thing and it didn't work, and this is just a variation of the idea. Okay. Could this be because the whole of OT knowledge is stored in paste bins? I mean, that definitely doesn't help. That Well, it's not just paste bins, it's also Twitter threads and Discord messages that are hard to find. If only we had, like, some sort of centralized database where we could put everything. Like, one website that would just be dedicated to listing all the glitches we have, something like that. I think that'd be really good for the game. We just had one central database for everything. Yeah, we could call it just Zelda... speedrunsofzelda.com or something. You know, with all the things we need for speedrunning Zelda games. Speedrunning has to 100%. I mean, I'm making fun of myself when I say this. Like, I was one of the first people that was working on ZSR a long, long time ago. Working on ZSR as in, like, writing up stuff, not any code or anything. And I just got lazy and stopped making stuff for it. And so I'm making fun of myself. Don't worry. Oh yeah, so when people anonymously go into SVA's Nico Nico stream and give tips, that's the best way to find glitches. Yeah, this trick requires a ton of rerouting. It's back to rerouting for the next month or so. So what we could possibly do, there is a value for warping to Ganon that tilts you. Let me find it. So, we could potentially do the Ganon fight tilted now. Which would be great, but, uh, it's hard. The tilt actually makes the Ganon fight so much harder. But yeah, like, it's actually really hard because you can hardly crouch stab. Like, your crouch stab goes into the ground, and if you want to aim up, the highest you can aim up is like what it would normally be neutral. And jump slashes aren't great either. So, the game of fight would for sure be slower if you did this. Yeah, this is hard mode Ganon. The donation incentive, yeah, for sure. Although, the bad thing about it is uh, because this is a Y position, or X position uh, rotation, not a Z position rotation. Uh, you can actually get knocked out of this. Like, if Ganon hits me, I'll actually lose the rotation. I'll demonstrate. Yeah. That was not meant to be a demonstration. Okay. Demonstration's over. Enough demonstrating for now. The nice thing is that you don't even have to roll to get under Ganon's legs. You, you, you can just walk under. Oh, I guess that untilts you. Rip. Yeah, I'm just giving dry thumbnails. Okay, so now that this fully works and we have a setup, I guess it's time for routing already. Routing is going to be hard though, because we got to figure out. We have to figure out a lot of stuff for routing, honestly. We got to figure out what we don't want in child anymore to add to adult. And then we got to figure out how are we going to get from point A to point B as adult. So this is pretty much where we're going to be uh, stopping the child route. Like, right, this is right before Furore's Wind on B in the current route. And this is pretty much where we're gonna stop. I think... I think we can just warp to lens game here now. Oh, sick. I didn't even try to get a tilt. That was just a happy accident. And then since we have no problem... Or wait, can the tilt? No, okay. Since we have no problem with unequipping F-boots now, just... Just let him go. Because this will be like at the end of the child section anyway, so... We get to use F-boots for one last thing that... Uh, we couldn't otherwise use it for. Oh! We're trapped! <laughs> I forgot. Uh, I mean, we could save warp, but honestly it's probably not worth it. Okay, maybe this isn't good. This is your punishment for cheating. This is getting trapped. 
die on the fire, I wish. Batlink. Okay, I think I might just stop for now, because I can't, I'm not really doing anything. We're kind of just brainstorming ideas. I think I gotta like come up with more ideas off stream and then hopefully tomorrow or worst case scenario in the next few days I can start working on some routing stuff. But yeah, I think I'll stop for now guys.